welcome back everyone. In studio now we have Olivia with Minari Body Works. We're going to talk about several different types of salt and their healing powers in our body. But Olivia, I want to start off by letting folks know the story that you shared with me about how you became interested in this to begin with. Yeah, so um, working in spas, I'd always, I'd always heard as well, you know, take a soak in salt if you're mm -hmm. feeling any sort of like muscle stiffness. And my husband and I, for his 30th birthday, we went on a backpacking trip to Yosemite. Mm. So it was supposed to be a four day backpacking trip, but it ended up being a three day backpacking trip, which is a story for a no longer time. segment. <laughs> yeah. um, but it was uh, really intense that last day because we had, it was a 2000 foot elevation gain, like total oh. throughout the whole trip. So oh, the last day we had to like basically like run to the bus to not, ca to not miss the last bus mm -hmm. that was going out. And when we got off of that 20 minute bus ride to get to our car, we could barely walk. Mm. And then we drove for three and a half hours back to San Francisco. So if you can only imagine how we felt then, we just felt like blocks of wood. Mm -hmm. um, luckily I had some Dead Sea salt at home um, to soak in and we both took a really, really salty soak that night. And I'm telling you, we felt fine the next day, wow. which was really surprising to both of us. Um, and it has to do with how many minerals are in the Dead Sea salts. Mm. Um, so it was a really powerful experience. Yeah, yeah, that's really cool. And so you brought a few different types of salts. Mm -hmm. And so let's maybe, we can start with the, the Dead Sea salts. Any more you want to talk about that? I know you said it has a lot of minerals in it. Yeah, so. it has over 21 different minerals in it. One of them you'll find in, in the Epsom salts, which is the magnesium sulfate, mm -hmm. which is a mineral that your body uses um, a lot of. And so we need a lot of it within ourselves at any given time. Um, but the Dead Sea salts also have like bromine, zinc, mm -hmm. Uh, calcium, sodium, sulfur, and all of these things just do uh, um, different things for mm -hmm. us, including like relaxing the nervous system, mm. relaxing the muscle tissues, reducing soreness and stiffness. Sodium actually does that, which I found quite surprising. Mm. Um, and sulfur helps your body, it works with your liver to help your body get rid of toxins. Um, so on a cellular level, they're doing lots of things for you. Um, and when we think about, you know, how everybody's saying, you know, eat a lot of fruits and vegetables, we do that to get these trace minerals, right, mm -hmm. into our bodies. And this is just another way to do it, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the heat from the bath, uh, not only does it block pain receptors, so if you are feeling any pain, you can get a temporary relief in that way. But um, the mineral molecules are actually small enough to pass through your skin oh, and wow. go into your bloodstream and then are used throughout the body. Mm. So well, not only are you temporarily relieving that pain, but then you're also giving your body those minerals to make repairs. Okay. And is um, that true of all of these that you brought today? Yes, Pretty much? for yeah. sure. Oh, yeah. yeah. So oh, the Himalayan salts, like I said, they have 21 different minerals in them, but the Himalayan salts have 84 different oh, minerals. Wow. Okay. So even more. So it does really well to kind of like mix them up. Sure. Mm. And that's something that we like to do at Minari too. Um, so that you get the strength of the Dead Sea salts, but then you get the trace minerals that are in the Himalayan salts. Um, because those trace minerals just do really interesting and different things. And we don't get a lot of them in our normal day-to-day -day diet. Sure. All right, yeah. some great information. So and you have a whole blog on this on your website as I well. I do, yeah. Yeah, I really, um, I find it really fascinating and it's really helpful, you know, especially in my job to be able to explain how it works to um, clients. Because if you just tell someone to take a soak in Epsom salts, then they might just go, well, why would I want to do mm -hmm. that? You know, yeah. what is it really going to do for me? But the science is really there. It can actually do a, re a lot of things for you. So. Folks, check it out. Olivia with Minari Body Works. All right. More on Kate Olivia when we come back. Stay with us.